Our coverage of Colorado starts tonight with the weather alert. Strong winds toppled trucks. This truck was trying to drive on I-70 near Georgetown when it blew over. Another tanker flipped on Highway 72. Winds are as strong as a hurricane in some parts of our state right now. This wind warning goes into the night. Gusts so strong, Clear Creek County schools closed because of the danger to buses. Meteorologist Chris Spears live in Clear Creek County tonight. I see you got your prop already, Chris. <laughs> yeah, and believe it or not, we just had 35 mile an hour wind gusts. Of course, we come on air and the wind is now down to 15 miles per hour. But even that, you can see what it's doing to this flag. Now 25.6. Earlier today, we had a gust here of 96 miles per hour. And you can see the waters and the white caps on Georgetown Lake behind me. Let's take a look at some of the wind gusts around the front range right now. Still seeing plenty of double digit numbers. In fact, Birth and Pass, you've been up in the 50s and 60s all day. We've seen winds in Boulder as high as 30 and better, even at times in the east side of Metro Denver. Let's take a look at the high wind warning. This does go until midnight for the Front Range Mountains and the Front Range Foothills. Back out here live, uh, we have a 24 mile per hour wind. Of course, we're being sheltered right now by the truck. How long do these winds last? Lord Whitney will have your full forecast coming up in just a little bit. We're live at Georgetown Lake covering Colorado first. Meteorologist Chris Spears. Thank you, Chris.